joins me on the line now with the latest. Good evening, Tracy. Good evening. What can you tell us about the clashes? Uh, well, it started again, as it did on Thursday, um, started again as a peaceful protest this morning, uh, but it turned violent when the, the people started burning tires in the street and again throwing uh, stones and, at, at uh, military soldiers who opened fire once again, and, and this time the uh, police came in uh, and arrested uh, 10 people today. And can you tell us exactly what the protesters are demanding? They're protesting against corruption in the government of the, uh, uh, the Kurdistan regional government. Uh, they're actually calling for the government to stand down, um, is it, it, one of their, their main demands. But uh, they're protesting about unemployment, about uh, corruption, about um, uh, lack of basic services also in the Kurdish region. Do we know uh, if the protesters are going to continue this demonstration or? Has this been the end of it? Yes, no, there's, uh, there's, uh, the uh, students of the Fulmani University have said they'll protest uh, every day. Uh, tomorrow they're planning on protesting again at 10 a.m. as they began this morning. Uh, we don't know if that, um, hopefully that it will be a peaceful protest as planned, but uh, the last two protests have turned off, so we don't know what's, uh, what's going to be installed for tomorrow. The, the protests started peacefully. People were out there demanding what you just uh, said, but it turned violent. Uh, do we know who provoked the, perhaps the uh, riot police there, or, or the attack was unprovoked? Uh, on Thursday, on, on Thursday, the police came in and it was actually the protesters, as they what marched through the streets, they came to the KDP building and just a, a number of them, not, not the entire group, of course, but um, a small number of the protesters began um, causing damage to the, to, the, to the area and trying to damage the building, throwing stones. Um, without warning, though, the uh, military opened fire uh, on the crowd, and many of them were not causing any damage. There was maybe the... 40, 50 people that were throwing stones, but around more than a thousand were in the crowd. Um, so the, this uh, has sparked, um, today this sparked um, uh, quite a lot of anger. And uh, many of these people, uh, I, I would assume, was probably their own step, uh, began with burning tires in the streets. And um, yeah, this, this caused also another police reaction, this time not as harsh as on Thursday. But um, police this time moved in and began arresting people rather than just um, shooting at the crowd. Press TV is Tracy Shelton, Shelton in uh, the Iraq's Kurdistan city, Soleimania. Thank you. And thank you for watching this broadcast. More news on our website at PressTV.ir. Our rolling coverage of the events in Bahrain will continue to stay with us.